All right, let's get to the Rand Paul, Anthony Fauci brawl. So let me explain the origins of this, please. There are Americans, and Senator Paul is one of them, who believe that China made the coronavirus in a lab and it escaped. Everybody understand that? Okay. And there are millions and millions of people who believe that. The medical community, and that's Fauci, they don't, they won't cop to it. Okay. They think it was some kind of permeation of a virus that got out of control in Wuhan, but it wasn't a contrived manufacturing of a virus. There was American money that went into the Wuhan lab just to investigate viruses. That money was um, put there. The phrase gain of function is very important. So gain of function is a controversial method where researchers, medical researchers, make a virus. They make it, okay? And they then test it to get a vaccine. So they manufacture a virus and they make it as bad as they can make it in the hopes that they can get a counter to it. That is called gain of function. Evidence is that American money went into the Wuhan lab to study gain of function, and that led to the COVID virus breaking out of that lab. That's the best way I can explain it. All right. So Fauci, who I've said many times, is a politician, not a man of science. He does what he is told to do. When he worked for Trump, He did what Trump told him. When he's working for Biden, he's doing what Biden told him. So they haul him in front of the Senate Health Committee um, yesterday. And here's how it went down with Senator Paul. Dr. Fauci, knowing that it is a crime to lie to Congress, do you wish to retract your statement of May 11th where you claimed that the NIH never funded gain-of-function research in Wuhan? Senator Paul, I have never lied before the Congress, and I do not retract that statement. This paper that you are referring to was judged by qualified staff up and down the chain as not being gain of function. So what was, let you me take, finish. You take an animal virus and you increase its transmissibility to humans, right. you're saying that's not gain of function? Yeah, that is correct. And, and Senator Paul, you do not know what you are talking about, quite frankly, and I want to say that officially. You do not know what you are talking about. Okay, so there's no resolution to this. It's not like the uh, communist leaders in Beijing are going to go, yeah, 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 we screwed up and it got out of the lab. We made it and now everybody's dead all over the world. They're never going to do it. There are whistleblowers, Chinese scientists who say they made that virus and it got out of that lab. But that's never going to be established beyond a reasonable doubt. There's always going to be doubt because it's communism. You don't have reporting there. They don't allow anybody. If you're a a scientist in China and you say that, you're done. You're in a gulag. Fellow Americans, I am concerned about the U.S. dollar. Huge debt, as you know. Will it stay as the world's reserve currency? That's why now more than ever, I recommend you diversify with gold and silver. And the only company I recommend and have for years is American Hartford Gold. I trust them. I've personally done business with them. They sell physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your IRA. And they make it very easy. So call them right now. Make sure you tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you. And they will give you up to $2,500 of free silver on your first order. Since I have been recommending American Hartford Gold, gold shot up more than 40%. Silver, more than 60%. So don't wait. Call them now. 866-501-5201. 
866-501-5201 or text BILL to 65532. Again, that's 866-501-5201 or text BILL to 65532. Bill O'Reilly here. Thank you for watching this video and make sure you subscribe to the First TV YouTube page. Just hit the big red subscribe button below and you'll get clips and highlights of my program, The No Spin News, every single day. We'll see you soon.